You ready to go to the movies? Oh, my God, you've been dumped again. <laughs> what? That mound of cookies means you've been dumped. Now, tell me who it is so I can get my friend at the IRS to make his life a living hell. Now, Ma, these are for Dee Dee. Oh. You know, that Dee Dee sure is healing slow. You know what I think? I'll tell you what I think. I think all that soft living has made that child frail. She's just a big little wimp. Ma, why do you always assume the worst about Dee Dee? Because the apple doesn't fall far from the heifer. <laughs> has actually been good for us. It has? Yeah. I mean, if I cared about her as much as she seems to care about me, well, she wouldn't be upstairs right now in pain and practically disabled. I can. Are you sure? I don't want you to change your plans just because of me. Oh, I don't mind. You know, I've actually kind of enjoyed hanging with you. See? Things happen for a reason. Your vicious and unprovoked attack actually brought us closer together. <laughs> so what you're saying is I should have kicked your ass ten years ago. Maybe I misspoke. <laughs> with the key Mona gave me so I could check on you. Now I'm in the middle of some mess. Well, you don't have to be. Just turn around, leave, and, and go to the men's clothing store of your choice on me. <laughs> I like you didn't see anything. I could use a new suit. <laughs> Ladies like a man in a suit. <laughs> I can't do that. Mona's my best friend. <sighs> OK, OK, I'm going to tell her. I just have to do it in my own way. Well, you better do it soon. If Mona finds out, I know she's going to blame me. Now, why would she do that? Wait and exhale, jungle fever, you always blame the black man. Seriously, Spencer, I'm starting to worry about Dee Dee. I mean, it's been a few days, and she seems to be getting worse. Well, you saw her last night. What do you think? I think she didn't look like I thought she would. Everything's going to be fine. Trust me. Well, how can you be sure? I'm not. I'm not. Why you gotta be up in my business, woman? Mona, you have a visitor out front. Really? Who? I'm paid to take messages over the phone, not in person. Oh. Okay, what's up? What's up with what? I sit at my desk every day with a book. Do you really think I'm reading? <laughs> yes. Please. I don't even know the title. <laughs> I'm watching people. And when you twirl your fingers like that, you're hiding something. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. We can do this easy or we can do it rough. <laughs> Either way, I've got all day. <sighs> Fine. Dee Dee's not really injured and she's been faking it. Happy? Oh, that's good. And it'd be a shame if Mona found out you knew. <laughs> you wouldn't. I'm 30 and I'm still a receptionist. There is very little I wouldn't. <sighs> okay, what'll keep you quiet? Oh, wait! Forget I asked that. <laughs> Too late! There's a certain self-defense instructor I know I could impress if you pretended to mug me and I kicked your ass. <laughs> you want me to let you kick my ass in public? Well, other people can see. Can I just give you some tickets to the Ice Capades or something? This year, without Scott Hamilton? I don't think so. Adam, there wasn't even anyone out 
there. What's going on? Dee Dee isn't really injured. She's been playing you and Spencer knew about it. Oh, wouldn't I? <laughs> she what? Dee Dee's faking in our quarter. But she said she was going to tell you. And you just let her play me? See? Blame the black man! Honey, Dee, if you are not better soon, I insist that you consider taking stronger medication. I always have mother's little helpers close by. Hey! Oh, Dee, I know how much you've helped with my baby, and I want to apologize for accusing you of intentionally hurting her. It's just with your being raised in a house full of anger, I tend to assume the worst. <laughs> Notice that. Oh, indeed. If you change your mind about what we discuss, call me. <laughs> hey, Nona, I was thinking we could have Chinese again. Okay, time to drop the act, Dee Dee. Is it your fun making a fool out of me? <laughs> oh, Mona, could you fluff my pillow? Oh, Mona, could you hear my muffin? Oh, Mona, could you loop on my ashy ankles? Okay, okay, I admit it. I milked the injury a little. A little? Hey, I'm a drama queen. It's in my blood. <laughs> but Mona, these last few days have been so great. For once, I didn't have to chase you down. You were with me because you chose to be. No, you manipulated me into it. Details. <laughs> the point is, we were finally spending time together. We spend plenty of time together. You're always at my place, or dragging me to lunch, or shopping, or introducing me to your friends. Yeah, I've spent more time with you in the past nine months than I ever have in my entire life. Isn't that enough? No. I want more, and sometimes I feel like I'm the only one who cares if we ever get any closer. Oh, Dee Dee, I care. But you can't force relationships. Your problem is you're just used to getting what you want when you want it. That's a problem? <laughs> yes. Now, Dee Dee, we're sisters. That's not going to change. But you got to give me room. So I guess this means you don't want to hang out with me tonight. No, I'm mad at you. <laughs> Are you going to stay mad long? <laughs> you just don't give up, do you? Nope. And I'm not going to. What am I going to do with you? How about a day at the spa? My treat. I guess I could still hold a grudge while being exfoliated. <laughs> no use being mad and scaly. <laughs> What's taking so long in there? You go to Ego Land for those waffles? <laughs> Sorry. I wanted them to be perfect. See? Just the way you like them. Browned around the edges with half Mrs. Butterworth, half Mrs. Butterworth light. <laughs> Ooh, you should keep secrets from me more often. I like this making it up to me thing. <laughs> so now we square? Oh, not even close. Start a rubbing. <laughs> And after this, you're going to give me a pedicure. <laughs> and then we're going to dye your...